In this video, I'm going to show you one of our favorite exercises for glute hypertrophy. I like to call this a split stance glute rotation. Um, picked it up a little bit from uh, the Gray Institute, but something you can do is you can get a little bit staggered split stance, not too, not too far apart, um, not too wide this way, but also not too narrow. I got some pretty heavy weight here. Uh, you want to start you know, fairly heavy, but not super heavy. You might even have to just accomplish the movement with no weight here. So I got 60s, um, but I got most of my weight here up on my front leg. Slight bend in the knee, but I'm not actually doing a lot of movement through the knee. I'm doing it through the hip. So we know the hip does internal, or what we want to do to strengthen the hip is we want to go into internal rotation, flexion, and adduction. Because we're going to have three primary glute muscles that are going to do extension, external rotation, abduction. So I'm trying to hit a little bit of the posterior glute mean, glute max predominantly by doing that rotation, doing that flexion, and then that adduction component really can hit more of that uh, glute mean. Wanna do this exercise with a decent load, but we're going through a rep range that's gonna be um, concurrent to what our goal is, which is hypertrophy in this case. So we're looking for you know, 12 reps or something like that maybe four sets per leg. Here, in that position, I'm gonna rotate down and forward. It's not a big movement, but I'm rotating forward, flexing a little bit, nice posture. That knee is allowed to rotate. I'm taking my back knee, and I'm actually dipping it down towards my calf. And you should feel like a slight stretch in your glute at the bottom of the exercise. So it's a rotation. So it's more of the internal rotation lengthening, the adduction lengthening, and then the flexion lengthening. A combination of those three, and then I have to come eccentric to concentric out of it with the glute muscles. So you know if we want to strengthen those glute muscles, like I said, internal rotation, adduction, flexion. You can progress this exercise to uneven loads. You can use it as a more strength-based exercise. You can do more um, even an endurance style exercise or you can make it plyometric where you load and then come out. A lot of people have never actually felt what it feels like to train the glute because they're so hamstring dominant and the quad dominant in the way they move. So they might be quad dominant through here or their hamstrings might overpower their glute in exercises where they actually go through more of a hip hinge. Just a variation you can use. Um, you want to be successful at lower weights before you start to add load because you are doing some rotation on the knee. You are doing some rotation on the hip. And you want to make sure you can conquer that with proper posture. So I'll just show you the, the uh, other leg here. Nice little split stance. Rotate in, power out. 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 All right, so if you like this video, give us a thumbs up. Check out some of our other videos on hip abductor strengthening, some of our other videos on hamstring exercises, and we'll catch you in the next video. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't yet.